Hey everybody, Mia here from Ask a Little, Tell a Little, and it's election day. I'm so excited for that. I hope everybody got out there and voted, but first, let's get into it. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for listening. I just want to come to you guys today and talk a little bit about the election. I'm not going to get into it politically. I already voted. I voted a couple weeks ago and I hope all of you did too. Today's election day and we need to get out there and let our voice be heard. But before we go into that, I want to talk a little bit about what's been going on with this election in the last few weeks, months maybe this whole year. You guys, there's so much hatred going on, right? So much hatred going on on both sides. My question is why? Why are we doing this to each other? Yes, we have different political views. Yes, there are so many controversial things that are going on. But at the end of the day, we are all Americans. And honestly, the hatred is just ripping us apart as, as a nation. We need to be united. We need to be there for each other, building each other up. There used to be a time where we respected each other's difference of opinions. Now it's just insane. We don't even care. We hate each other because what side we're on. And honestly, it shouldn't be about sides. It should be about right and wrong. What is right for this country? What is right for people? And what is right for us as citizens? There are so many things that have been played on on both sides. Honestly, I personally think that we don't even have the greatest candidates this year on either side. There are so many things that I am against on both sides that I really think is sad that we have to put up with that as a nation. However, we are still people of this country. We need to bind together and really, really have each other's backs, really, really be there for each other because what happened to just kindness, right? The other thing is, is that we have the ability to go out there and change the world ourselves. We don't need to wait and rely on some leader or somebody else to do it for us. We can go out there and make a difference ourselves. We can put our feet on the ground, go into communities, we can paint houses, we can clean up trash. There's so many things that we can do. And honestly, this whole idea of, well, I'm just going to send money to a candidate or I'm just going to send money for a purpose is insane to me. It drives me crazy. As a person who for a, over a decade went out there and went into people's homes and actually made a real difference in the world, it drives me nuts when people sit there and say, well, I make a difference because, you know, I post on my social media or because I send money to this campaign or whatever. We really need to step up as a society, step up as people and go out there and actually do the work. What happened to communities coming together? What happened to us really putting in the time to make our communities and our country a better place? We have the ability to do that. Now, everybody thinks, well, my little contribution doesn't matter. It really does. If you just change one life, if you make a difference in one community and change one family's life, one per person's life, you are making a difference. Why are we not doing that? That is my question to you. This election day has been stressful. I'm finally glad it's over with. I'm excited to see who the president will be for the next four years. But regardless of what your view is or what your political stand is, we need to be better as people and we need to go out there and make a difference ourselves. That's what my podcast is all about. That's what this YouTube channel is going to be all about. I'm really excited to continue to keep talking to you guys. Tell me what you're doing to change your community or the, the world around you. I would love to hear it. I love to hear it from you guys reach out to me. I'm so excited that you guys are listening. Please continue and go out there and continue to be better people. Thank you so much, guys. I will talk to you soon.